until on the 1st of February 2008. We were 70 miles off the uh, Horn of Africa. We were attacked initially by one um, fast uh, white plastic skiff. How fast could your ship go? Oh, only about 12 knots an hour maximum, and they, they were doing 30, 35. We be began to devise a way of escaping, or at least make it possible for the Americans to attack and save us. So the plan was that on a given signal, all of us crew would make our way into the stern compartment behind steel watertight doors, black out the ship, shut all the lights off and everything. And when the American warship saw us blacked out, they would know that we were safe and they could attack. Um, they called for me first, Captain Colin, come out, come out. And, uh, Anyway, we arrive up on deck and we're told to lie down. And um, and then Omar, the captain, sort of says, up on the bridge. And he just sort of looked at me. And at last he said, Captain Colin, Captain Colin. He held out his hand and so I shook his hand. It was just as if you'd played a good game of squash, but you lost, you know. Eventually, the sum was agreed at, which the company would pay and it was acceptable to the pirates. And the money was physically handed over to the pirates and then the delivery boat disappeared. So of course at that point the pirates had the money and the ship and the hostages and we had to trust them to release us. What sort of effects has it had on you? Very little on me. 